Hi, today we're going to be talking about this item right in front of you here, the uh, G.I. Joe Snake Eyes Classified uh, Movie Origins, uh, and this is the Baroness, as you can see, it is an awesome figure. Um, I'm going to be talking about how much I paid, where I get it, and also just kind of give you guys a 360 regarding this figure and the boxing. I'm not going to be opening this uh, box. Um, before I get started, if you can actually hit the subscribe button on the bottom right corner, the red button, that'd be awesome. I'm trying to build on my subscriber base. If I've added value, definitely hit the like button. And feel free to leave me comments. I look forward to them. So let's begin. So this is the Baroness, the G.I. Joe, Snake Eyes Origins movie. Um, now, as you can see, I don't know if any of you guys seen the movie, but, you know, this one has a short hair. So very different from the comic book that came out uh, for G.I. Joe or the previous movies. Now, a bit about the uh, Baroness. Now, who is she? she basically, Baroness is a fictional character from a G.I. Joe Real American Hero. Um, and it originally appeared in the first issue of G.I. Joe Real American Hero comic book. So, those of you who collect comics, you'll probably know it was the very first issue of the comic book. The Baroness is a villain, villainous associated with the G.I. Joe team nemesis, Cobra. Now, Baroness serves as Cobra's intelligence officer and lieutenant to Cobra Commander. So that's kind of her role within the Cobra network. With long black hair, um, black rim glasses, and a black leather outfit, Baroness is a dark, sensual femme fatale whose beauty is matched only by the ruthlessness. She is often portrayed as being romantically involved with Destrel. So Destrel is another Cobra character that's... Um, in the comics, she's associated with a lot. So, um, the Baroness originally, when it first came out uh, on a previous G.I. Joe movie uh, that had The Rock, um, it was played by Sienna Miller. But for this, Snake Eye Origins, the movie, the Baroness is actually played by um, Ursula Corbero, who's a Spanish model actor so just wanted to put that out there so i'm not sure if any of you guys seen the movie but um i did um the movie's okay um i actually prefer the previous gi joe's movie a bit more but this one was very interesting to you by itself so this is the character this is the front of the box this is the side of the box this is the back of the box and then this is the other side of the box so as you can see it's pretty cool She's decked out all in black, and um, you know she has her weapons and everything in there. Now, how much did I pay for this? Um, I paid about twenty-two dollars for this, and I got it at my local Target store. Um, this figure is actually a bit hard to find, but you can probably get this figure probably on like any of those uh, online uh, stores that sell figures, probably for about the same price. Um, you just might have to pay a little bit extra for shipping, but most of the time. I think you can probably get it wolf shipping included for the same price. I picked this up because I was happened to be at Target and I just figure, you know, just might as well pick it up and don't have to worry about getting it online and also paying, uh, you know, wait for it to be shipped. And so that way I can do a video here to share it with all of you guys. So once again, um, this is the figure. This is the top of it and this is the bottom of it. Um, it looks pretty good. Here's the face. If you can see the face right there. And then she has her... Uh, two weapons she has her glasses uh, she has her outfit the leather outfit cobra logo on there uh, her gun her boots as you can see on the bottom down here as you can see from this picture you know it's very similar to um the um actor who plays the baroness uh in snake eye origins the movie for gi joe and it's from hasbro and it's baroness classified gi joe classified series basically that's what they call it but it's snake eyes origins gi joe origins you can say that but um yeah this one um let me know what you guys think uh if you guys have one of these and also if you guys have uh trouble looking finding it at local stores because for me um you know it wasn't always available at target but um i just happened to be there one day and it was there so i grabbed it Anyway, if you guys can, hit the subscribe button once again. I'm putting it on my subscriber base, and I'll be posting new videos Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Till next time, take care.